I was super excited I to just to swim the 100 back because I, I rested a little bit for this meet because it'll be one of my main focus. This was a main focus meet before kind of going into the summer. So it was one of my last chances to really go fast. Uh, and I knew I wanted, the goal going into it was uh, be top three out of the boys. Oh. I didn't achieve that, but I'm happy with the time that I went and I'm happy with the high school record and all. by far the most exciting meet I think I've ever been to, and that's including Winter Nationals, Summer Nationals, Pan Ams, Junior Pan Backs, NCAP Invite. It's, this meet has the most energy surrounding it, and all the swimmers there are, are there to swim fast, and they're excited about it. Just with the environment of having the public school and private school, it, it does build a rivalry, and it's a lot of fun. It's by far my favorite meet. <laughs> Although swimming is an individual sport, uh, like you are swimming alone, you are you do have your own lane, it has a lot of team aspects in it, being the relays that you do, cheering with your team, and that's really what draws me to it. I grew up playing soccer, basketball, ice hockey, and those are all big team sports. You have to rely on your, on your teammates, and swimming has that less, but when I'm on a relay just at the end of this meet, it's it's the best feeling because you're you're relying on your teammates and you want them to, you want them to Everybody please pick up it's trash. All that team. Definitely both. I, I do keep in touch with her. Not a lot, but every time we see each other at meets, she's always willing to talk. Um, I know if I do need to get in touch with her because I have a question or something, I'm able to. Uh, and she's a big inspiration to me. Just showing that from like an area like this, you can really go on to become something incredible. And I think she's a big inspiration to not just me as a swimmer, but a lot of the swimmers in this area really look up to her. Well, going into the spring, it'll be NCSAs, and then after that, it's just train, train, train till late June. June when Olympic trials starts, I'll head over to Omaha and see what I can do.